Good morning, John. There is a roast yourself challenge happening right now. I've got some lyrics. We're gonna do it, it's probably a bad idea. Yo, what's up, Hank Green? Here to roast myself like Ryan Higa said. Give it all that I gotta give. I haven't even started already feeling culture appropriative. Here I am, sitting where I sit every Thursday morning. Yeah, Thursday, cause I'm careful, I'm normal, I'm boring. I'm not gonna risk a punishment. I no longer have time for that. I keep adding to my list, cause I like getting hit with baseball bats. Nah, it's cause I like how it makes me feel. Like I matter, cause I'm doing things even though it's not real. I wanna be remembered. But here's what's pretty clear. Someday there will be no humans left to remember anybody was here. I need approval from society, so I do what it expects from me. As a straight pale male, I can do it quite expediently. I sit in front of books, so that you know that I'm Smart, and while my brother has natural puff, I use the stuff I got at Walmart. The majority of my audience wants me to feel the burn, but I'm too old for revolution. I just don't want to feel the Donald Trump, okay? Spending money has always given me anxiety. I avoid cursing because my freedom is trumped by propriety, and I'll never be like pubes on the cover of Variety, and having a notable brother doesn't convey notoriety. I keep talking about a book that I'm gonna write someday, but it's never gonna be Tiffios, so why do I try anyway? But I love Snapchat like a tween, so let's do that instead. Taking cat snaps with my kill bar, doing it straight from my bed. I'm 36 years old and I pretend to be a punk rocker, but as you've probably heard, I'm a nerd who sings mostly about Harry Potter, and thanks to a teleprompter, I get to pretend that I know everything. about the standard model and philosophy, but mostly I'm just reading. So I pay people to do the things and to help me create. It's capitalism assisted by support, but my former self would hate. I pontificate like I'm an expert, but I'm really not that great. And yes, if she asked, I would be Hillary's running mate. But she's not gonna. Because I'm a gangly white dude. Roasting myself on YouTube! I'm maybe a little old to be doing this stuff. Maybe a little less silly in the future. Just chill it out a little bit. I, I, I feel like I feel like maybe focus on the educational stuff. Not that like the fun hip rapping challenges? That doesn't seem like a good idea. Nah. Thanks for bearing with me on that one, entire world. Not just the people who watched, everyone. I apologize. I don't know why I was like, hey, let's do a song challenge. You don't have enough to do right now. Uh, uh. If you're wondering if VidCon is coming up, I try not to talk too much about VidCon because uh, most people can't go, uh, even though it's a really good time. But. For the first time ever this year, thanks to a sponsorship from YouTube, we are going to be able to live stream significant portions of the event. So yay! People who can't go, at least know that's a thing. If you want to check it out, please do. Thanks to Ryan Higa for injecting some silly into the YouTube community. We'll take ourselves too seriously sometimes. No doubt about that. Also, this is the thing we're doing now. It's a little tiny French llama vinyl toy. And I think it's cute. We've never done toys like this before. It's uh, $7 and you can get it at dftba.com. If there's a way for me to apologize for ever rapping, uh, just let me know in the comments. John, I'll see you on Tuesday. Tuesday, not Wednesday, never Wednesday, Tuesday. What the heck?